Happy Independence Day, everyone. Hope you're all doing good. Welcome, 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 welcome. Hope you're all having a great holiday. And if you're not in the United States, not sure if you celebrate this or not, but it's a holiday. Hope you're having a good day. Uh, today, we're going to play a little PlayStation action. Uh, I did want to kind of, so this is uh, Motion Blue, it looks like, running a Hirsty Blue theme. What's up, Fragment Freedom? What's up, Sansi? What's up, Burns Lumber? We got some people in here fast. Look at that. That's on my, that's on my notification crew. Jason, what's up? Uh, it's on a Motion Blue. Let's go ahead and see what version of RetroPie this is running. Oh, first we should probably lower the sound here. Let's go to 75. Let's go to 70. Okay. Now we won't blow your ears out anymore. What's up, uh, Twoddle for Fool? What's up, Paps, man? Still haven't got my shirt yet. All right, so this is running 4.2. So this is probably um, Motion Blue version 4. Okay, 4.2 on this one. Uh, what are we going to do here? Um, so it's basically just Cody picks a stock build with the PlayStation titles on it. You can always use... Uh, you know, emulation station. Like I said in my previous couple of videos, I'm a big fan of the emulation station on the Motion Blue. You get the video snaps, you get the, uh, you know, jump to a letter. Uh, it's just really well organized. So, uh, but I think a lot of you, I haven't done a track mode in a little while. So let's, um, oops, I didn't want to launch that game. What up, Don Don? What up, 321 My Destiny? What up, Digital Town? Um, sorry, I didn't want to load this game. Let's leave. Bye. Okay, I want it to go into a track mode. Let's let's go switch to a track mode. So I haven't I've been doing these motion blue videos, um, these last couple videos. It does come with a track mode as well, and it's fairly easy to set up. So really cool stuff there. This is a 128 gigabyte PlayStation image. Unfortunately, you know I'm not going to be giving out links uh, in the actual video. Sorry, I just can't do it. But uh, this is an interesting one. A friend of mine uh, produced, and I'm excited to check it out as it's a updated version. Brand new off the press. I said hello, Digital Town. I think there's a delay on the stream, that's why. You're right, I miss you at first, but I did say hello after. Yeah, 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 playing a little retro pot on the holidays. That's fun. There's a little uh, video when you're over PlayStation. Then you have your options, and you have options in PlayStation. Whoop. Options. You get your typical attract mode stuff, loading screens, reset attract mode. You can update attract mode, retro arc configuration, shut down reboot, go back into emulation station, connect to the Wi Fi, show your IP address, Raspberry Pi config, retro Pi setup. Audio settings, Bluetooth settings, change your introduction video, change those splash of screens, display utilities, configuration editor, file manager, and then back to loading screens. Okay, so we got PlayStation here. You can't hear the TV. Can you hear the snaps right now? Can you hear the Jet Moto 2? Can you hear the video? <laughs> your upload is double your download. That's pretty crazy. All these leechers, huh? All these little leechers over here. Uh, yeah, no favorites, it looks like. You could probably turn those on or off, though, if you want. Easy to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, you guys can hear it. All right, so where should we start? Should we start with A? Should we go down the alphabet here? Okay. Starting with A. We got Ace Combat 2. Activision. This was on the last one. This was on the last one. This was on the last one. I believe Alone in the Dark was. Alondra and Alondra 2 were on it. 
Ape Escape, great game, by the way. If you want to dig some hours in the PlayStation titles, this is a good one to... Um... Is my 32 gig of hentai game? I'm pretty sure it is. Arc the Lad. See, I'm not sure. See, some of you... I'm not really into these RPGs as much, so I wasn't sure if this one was on the previous one or not. Armored Core 1 and 2. The Mech Warrior type stuff. Some more RPG action. Some cool fighting. Battle Arena. 1, 2, and 3. Blaster Master. Little tank game. Blazing Dragons. Looks like a fun full throttle type of game. Or Day of the Tentacle, if you will. It's better now. I can raise it up even a little more if you want. How about that? How's that? That's that's max volume I got here. Greetings from Argentina. Greetings from America. Momo Slappy, what's up, dude? Papa Linus. What's up? We got Bloody Roar 1. Nice. Bloody Roar 2. Very good. Bomberman World. Brave Fencer. Is it Mushashi? Musashi? Breath of Fire 3 and 4. Bubble Bobble Part 2. Bushido Blade 1 and 2. Dang, Chauncey, 1 a.m. You're in Thailand, right? Well, enjoy Thailand. Hello, Mr. Cannon Fodder. What's up, man? Bust a Move Arcade Edition 2. We definitely got to play a little bit of that. Crash Racing. Many of you have seen this on the pie. It runs great. Capcom vs. SNK Pro. Great fighting game. Really, really good stuff right there. Castlevania and Castlevania Chronicle. You see this on a lot of pie builds. You don't see Chronicles on a lot of pie builds. Oh, I've never tried this game before. Chocobo. Chocobo Racing. Chocobo's Dungeon. Chrono Cross. Man, this is an RPGer's uh, favorite thing. This kind of reminds me of Alone in the Dark. Clock Tower. IT Crowd, happy for to do. Happy Independence Day. Contra. Cool Borders. Cool Borders 2. Crash Bandicoot. Crash Bandicoot Warped. Crash Bandicoot 2. Crash Bash. Croc. There's a lot of cool adventure games, you know, between the Croc, Spyro the Dragon, Crash Bandicoot, Darkstalkers, Darkstalkers and Night of the Warriors, and Darkstalkers 3. Alright, TV volume, get that dead or alive. Destruction Derby, Destruction Derby 2, Destruction Derby Raw. Devil Dice, Diablo, great game. I don't know, again, I'm, I, this is a really fun game right here, Die Hard Trilogy. Die Hard Trilogy, Viva Las Vegas. So for those that want to play like a GoldenEye type game on Pi, Die Hard, Die Hard 2 will run way better than uh, Goldeneye will for N64, that's for sure. Dino Crisis 1 and 2. I'm really bad at those type of games, so I'm probably not going to play it. Terry Pratchett's Discworld. In a second-hand set of dimension. In a... Doom. Dragon Ball GT Final Bout. Dragon Ball Z Ultimate Battle 22. Dragon Warrior 7. At least these guys move pretty fast in this game. Driver, you are the only. And then Driver 2 was on the other one as well. Duke Nukem Time to Kill. Not the best Duke Nukem, but Duke Nukem nonetheless. Where's Pepsi Man? We gotta get the Pepsi Man. Evil Dead. Hail to the King. Fighting Force, Final Doom, Final Fantasy V, 6, 
Chrono Trigger Final Fantasy Chronicle. Oh, that's cool. It's like a throwback. What's the story on this Chrono Trigger Final Fantasy Chronicles? Seems like it's a remake or like it's an old... Um... Oh, it's a two-in-one game. We get Final Fantasy IV and Chrono Trigger. Is that right? Because this looks like the original Chrono Trigger. This is not a re revert, reamp version. Wow. All you Final Fantasy fans are just going to... Poof! You're not going to know what to do with yourselves with all these Final Fantasies. Future Cup. Yeah, release dates are at the bottom of the screen. You got release dates, the disc, um, what kind of game it is. And a couple of them have logos. Darius, GP, G Police, Gauntlet Legends, great game right here. Spend some time on that one. You got Gex. See, I played Gex for the PC. I haven't played it for the PlayStation much. Ghost in the Shell. This is on the other one. G Gran Turismo 2. Nice. No, this is our Gran Tur Is it 2? Gran Turismo. Yeah, 2. This is the game right here. GTA 2. More RPGs. Grandia. Guilty Gear. Harmful Park. What's Harmful Park? It looks like a... Where's the gameplay here? Ah, uh, okay. Harvest Moon, Back to Nature. It's in remake with cutscenes added. Okay, on the Chrono Trigger. Thanks, Paps. Yeah, Chrono Trigger, I spent so much time in the game. I loved it. We got some golf. Hot Shot 1 and 2. Hydro Thunder. Intelligent Cube. Jersey Devil. I never played Xenogears, did you? Do you like it? Ah, uh, there's a simulation disc of Grand Theft Auto 2. Maybe it didn't run. Maybe that was the problem. Jim out of 1, 2, and a 3. Forever with me. That's a cool logo. A lot of cool fonts going on there with this logo. Even the um, the front of the box is kind of interesting, too. Doesn't that look like a StarCraft II probe on the... Oh, it's a shooting game. Interesting. Yeah, no PS2 on the Pi right now. When the next Pi comes out, you could do it. ETA Prime has some other videos with... Um, with them like better single board computers, or you can do it on your computer. You could just do it on your normal desktop computer, but some of these, there are some single board computers out there that'll run. PlayStation 2, GameCube, things like that. Um, but right now, the Pi 3, that's, those are the limitations. King of Fighters Evolution. Klonoa. Crazy Ivan. Watch out for crazy Russian Ivan. <laughs> is that kind of racist? Like that the crazy Ivan, like he looks Russian, right? And the star is uh, like a, on the Russian flag, right? And Ivan is a Russian name. LSD, okay, this has gotta be an interesting game. You're off to a barbecue. All right, Fragment Freedom, set off some fireworks for us. Enjoy your, your day. Xenogears, okay, we'll check it out. What's up, MLP? MLP in the house. We seem to be uh, playing on this MLP thing here. All right, I got to check out LSD later. It's kind of intriguing. Seems like one of those games you might get a uh, some sort of a seizure while playing it. Soul Reaver. A lot of people request that game a lot. So there you go. Legend of Dragoon. Some more RPG action. Legend of Mana. Loaded, which looks like a wannabe Contra corpse. That looks pretty good. Lunar. Lunar 2. You got your classic fighter games, Marvel Super Heroes vs. Street Fighter. So there you go. We got an expert in the chat here. <laughs> we can tell you all the reasons why and who. He's our modern-day Steve Jobs here. You buy the iPhone, he explains why. 
Marvel vs. Capcom, great game. Matt Hoffman's Pro BMX. I never played a lot of this game. I played more of the Tony Hawk. But it looks like a total ripoff of Tony Hawk, so it's probably going to be fun. But I got to watch out for those, um, those copyright songs. Now uh, Outcast is going to be after me at this point. How many giggies? 128, man. It's in the title. Oh, this looks kind of cool, like um, Metal metal Gear, or it's kind of like GoldenEye, too. Was this game any good? Is it worth trying out? Medal of Honor Underground? Look at that. Look at that crouching skills he's got. Nice. Two-shot kill. Medieval? Yeah, no, I know. Perhaps it has a lot to do with the emulation of Nintendo 64. Yeah, a lot of people don't understand that, that a lot of it's just in the translation and the emulation. So, I mean, it could be that one day, like tomorrow, we wake up and all of a sudden, you know, Nintendo 64 is running great for the Pi. I am using the F710, highly recommended controller for the PlayStation. Wireless, takes its own batteries, it vibrates as well. It automatically detects... Good job on MLP on this image, right when you boot up, it asks for your controls. Really easy to do so far. I haven't played a game yet, it should work fine. Man, you got all your Mega Mans, look at this, you got Mega Man 1, 2, 4, 5, 6, and 8. Jeez, you're gonna be Mega Man out. You got your Metal Gear Solid, the classic, 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 classic. All right, there you go. Metal Slug X. Beat that game many times. Mortal Kombat 4, Mortal Kombat Trilogy. Mist. Oh, man, I didn't know they made Mist for... Um... I didn't know they made it for PlayStation. I remember playing it on the Mac in Taj. I never got really far. I always got lost really, really quickly. Anybody here beat Mist? In the extreme NFL, man, he, uh, MLP was very um, nice to you guys. He gave you the golf, basketball, football. What else? Racing. I think there's some other sports on here. Oh, snowboarding, flying, some Odd World. You see, most of them come with Odd World Odyssey, not the uh, Abe's Exodus. So that's cool. Got one. Look at that. Parappa the Rapper. Pac Man World. Collect those. Uh... What is Pac Man eating? Are they. Is he eating baby Pac Man? Is he eating oranges? What is it that he's actually eating? No on Mist? Oh, you gotta try it. I heard it's good. I heard it's really hard. Yeah, there are some slowdowns in PlayStation with emulation for sure. Pandemonium. I know a lot of people were requesting that. Happy pills. <laughs> Steroids, happy pills, uh, antidepressants. Uh, one of those, right? I think we're getting close to Pepsi Man. Penzer Bandit, cool little animations here. Parasite Eve. Parasite Eve 2. Pepsi Man, with new artwork, I think. Is this new artwork with the rainbow? Nice. 1999. I like how it's got a little gun in the lower left-hand corner. Can you see that? Valium? Yeah, something like that. Cheese balls. Oh man, those big tubs of cheese balls, they're the best. Those are the greatest. The a Target. If you go to Target, you can get a big tub of cheese balls. Is 
They make a great PF2. You got Pocket Fighter. Populous, the beginning. Great, great idea for a game. And I know the newer versions of this are way better. Primal Rage, great game. Limited amount of characters, a great game. For those of you watching that didn't know, there is a like a, a beta slash re-release of Primal Rage 2. And it's a PC emulation. Check out my channel. I have a video on how to get that. If you're interested, it has more characters, things like that. And, it, and the humans turn into dinosaurs. It's kind of cool. So in case of those that aren't in the know, check that out if you're interested. Project Horned Owl. Looks like uh, Duke Nukem. Duke Nukem meets Transformer. Project Overkill. Looks pretty good. <laughs> Alright, Pabst. Alright, Pabst. You got it. Am I using the switchable power source? On this particular Pi I'm running now, no, but on my other Pi I do. It works fine, it works great. Yeah, go for it, dude. Costco cheese balls. I didn't know Costco's, my Costco doesn't sell cheese balls. It sells cheese in the shape of balls. It doesn't sell like the crunchy cheese balls though. Pepsi Man, greatest game ever. What's the count on this build? You know what? I, I need to go back and check that really quick. Let's get through the games here. We're going to get through these games. Raymond, very game as well. We're going to get through the games. We're getting close. Resident Evil 2, Resident Evil 3, Ridge Racer 4, Rival Schools, Road Rash, great game. Some more RPG action. Sega Frontier 1 and 2. Blades of Loot. Was it Bloots? Showdown. Samurai Showdown again. Whoop. Sorry, guys. Rush Extreme Racing. Oh boy, that doesn't look that doesn't look appropriate. Is this a? Uh... Okay, it doesn't. It seems like there's no nudity. It's just lots of bikinis. I thought I thought Mad Little Pixel threw in a little surprise there. Did I get the Swine Apple shirt? Oh, it's 260 games? Oh, okay. Silhouette Mirage. Silver Load. It looks like Oregon Trail meets something else. Simpsons Wrestling. Really interesting wrestling game. I've played a little bit of this on some previous videos. Soul Blade. Soul of Samurai. Oh, South Park. I might have to play this later. With the snowballs. Oh, great. Soviet Strike. Spec Ops 1 and 2, Spyro Year of the Dragon, Spyro Ripto's Rage, and Spyro the Dragon. Star Ocean, Star Wars Dark Forces, oh, I remember playing this on the PC. It was hard to see a lot of darkness, but like the game itself was pretty good. Like it had a good, see now this part, this gameplay looks dark as heck. I remember it looking a little nicer. But I remember the thermal detonators. You get some cool weapons in here. Yeah, play South Park while you can cheesy poos. I'm not fat, I'm just big boned. Street Fighter Collection. Which I imagine is like Street Fighter 2. Maybe some others. Street Fighter Plus Alpha. Street Fighter EX2 Plus. Strider. Strider 2. Strikers, 1945, some shoot 'em ups. Shook it in, shook it in two. So you have the Puzz Fighter and you have the mini Street Fighter Puzz Fighter. So you have the, the game, there have this, this one has both the kind of Tetris columns type game, but it also has the fighter as well. Uh, no link, guys. Thanks, MLP. You have a good fourth as well. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for the good times on the pod. Side filter one, two, and a three. Built trio there. Touring car challenge. Tactics ogre. Tail concerto. Tales of destiny one and two. Tekken. Tekken two. Tekken three. With vengeance. The tempest. 
to the third power. Oh, I remember playing this on the computer too. It's pretty difficult. I bet it'd be a lot easier with the analog stick though. Tenchu 1 and 2, Tetris Plus, great game. Oh yeah, you like that? So we have uh, Tempest 3X, which is an awesome, awesome game. Okay, we'll play some of that in a little bit. Tetris 2 Plus, Thousand Arms, Thrill Kill, Tobol 1 and 2, Tomb Raider 1, 2, and 3. The thing I never liked about Tomb Raider is a lot of it, there's a lot of downtime. I prefer a game with Tony Hawk 1 and 2. I prefer a little bit more Twisted Metal 1, Twisted Metal Small Brawl, Twisted Metal 2, Twisted Metal 3. Unjammer Lammy. Vagrant Story, Valkyrie Profile, Vampire Hunter, Vandal Hearts, Vandal Hearts 2, WrestleMania the arcade game, great arcade game. Warcraft 2, <laughs> Warhawk. Warcraft 2, by the way, it'll take you a really long time to play that game. Wipeout XL, Worms Armageddon, great game. Wu-Tang, fighting game. X-Men, Children of the Atom. X-Men vs. Street Fighter. Xenogears, everyone was saying about this, you like the game a lot, it's on there. And Zero Divide. Alright, one more thing I want to check was, let's go back to Emulation Station really quick. Dude, Tony Hawk 2 was a game changer. Great soundtrack, great fun, all sorts of stuff. So I unplugged the capture card and replugged it in, and that did the trick. I did not want to click in there. Let's cancel. We be back. We be back. All right. So I was playing. Te so this is good. Now I got like a free. Um, I got a free practice round on Tempest before you guys get to watch me suck at it. File name ascending, and we want. Okay, can you do that for me? All right, right? You guys see it now? Good evening, William Hendricks. I did restart the pie that didn't help, but I thought it would. Yeah, people just like explosions. I saw something on Facebook this morning. It was like the most American thing I could see. He was smoking a cigar, he's drinking his beer, he's wearing like a Speedo of an American flag with like a American flag bandana on. And the whole thing was like, you know, just to show like America freedom. And then he like puts on these like uh, these gloves that have fireworks attached to him and his friend lights them up and he's just like, America. <laughs> oh, God. I mean, people just do things just because they can. So good for them, I guess. Right. Did I ever overclock the mineral oil pie? No, not yet. I mean, it's just it's kind of one of those things I'm, I'll probably do it tomorrow or the next day. What it is is all these great images are coming out right now. And uh, I know a lot of people like to see them first thing. So, you know, I'm just I'm just kind of doing that for the moment. But uh, I will be overclocking it. Just wait. What I'm going to do, what do you guys think is the best way to um to do the um Oh, there it is. Oh. See, everything is the opposite. Um, so that's why I'm doing the images. But back on the, the whole overclocking, I am curious of how to do it. I was thinking what I would do is, um, if you go to the command prompt on the Pi, it'll tell you what the current temp is of the Pi, right? So I'll do surface temp, and then I'll also do the temp, um, in the command line as well. So I'll get the internal temp and then the external temp as well. And then I'll do it once I'll do it as it is right now, I'll go ahead and do a baseline. And then I'll go ahead and overclock to 1.35. And then I'll do 1.4. What do you guys think? Collect the yellow dotty things. Okay. 
Okay, now it's a square. Okay, those are bullets, though. Okay. I got- oh, I got an upgrade. Nice! So I'm guessing that you shouldn't spam, though, because you have, like, some sort of accuracy reading at the end of the level. Because so I could just spam, right? I could just go like this. Like, what's stopping me from just doing this? Well, I didn't hit that guy at all. That's one reason why. Oh, I see the yellow one right there. Sorry. It's actually kind of hard to control because it's like... It doesn't seem intuitive to me. Like... When it goes around the other side. Yes, yes, yes! I I think I got a one up there. I think one point... Clock it to 1.8. <laughs> Alright, dude. Sounds good. You're gonna donate me a pie when I... When a thing just, like, combusts in oil. Okay, what's this? That looks kind of scary. Oh, that's like a super. Oh. oh, I missed it. Oh, he caught me. That's cool that they catch him and they, like, bring you down like spiders. It's kind of cool. Yeah, don't forget to smash that like button if you guys are in here. If you're enjoying the stream, enjoying the PlayStation, please smash that like button so what are some other games we want to check out oh i want to play south park for sure yeah i know almost nine thousand subscribers and like i said i have that giveaway um coming soon as well Put the fish tank in your freezer while you overclock it. That could be interesting. <laughs> My free, I have a French door freezer though. Don't ever buy a French door free, not a French door, but uh, where the freezer like pulls out, you know, on the bottom, I hate it. I wish I knew that before I um, space. bought it. A horror approaches. All right, here we go. What are options here? Music volume, control. Who should I be? Who should we be? Yeah, where are my cheesy pills? Come on, character. Who's got the character? Three, two, one. All right, Kenny it is. I really gotta be, let's be Stan. Press start or X button. Okay. Yeah, those fridges suck. I would have gone you, the thing is, A, they suck because... Okay, what are my controls here? Okay, that's throw. That's jump. Oh, that's aim up and down. Oh, there's like something after me! Oh, boy. Oh, there's more. Oh, boy. My aim here. Some weird controls here, guys. I just thought I thought Kenny. Okay, hey Kenny. Okay, we met Kenny. Oh, we gotta catch all of our friends. Okay. Oh, we gotta follow the map here. I can't go that way though. Oh, I see something on the map. There you are, buddy. I got gotcha. you. We got Cartman. Oh boy. Ah. I thought I got him. Oh, whoops, I'm going the wrong way. Gotta follow the arrow, right? That's a dead end. Is that the, is it arrow telling me like where north is or? Can I go in here, in the trash can? Looks like there might be something back here.
there's a delay in the sound it's not matching the video do you guys have the same experience oh i see a blue dot so now we have everybody Ah! P on the snow. How do you do that? Oh, there we go. Yellow snowball. Nice. I just did it. I peed on the snow. Look at me go. All right, where do we have to go here, Pete? Oh, this thing just finished line. We gotta go to the... Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Lots of turkey. Oh, they don't like my grenade. Oh, come on. I gotta turn off the... Die, little turkey, die! Click back out, and it's working now. Follow the radar. But follow the arrow, or what? Oh, shoot. That's a lot of turkeys. Ah, oh, they're all around me! What? Oh, there's two more. And now I have a green dot here. What's the green dot? Food? What does the green dot mean? Oh, do I have to put out the fire here? What's well, green? What does this mean? Oh, there he is. He's right there. He's inside the... Hey, I have to get him, right? Do I have to do something with this bunny? Okay, I guess not. What's up, Squeaky? Thanks, man. I'll keep grinding. You know me. Grinding on the holiday, hanging out with my peeps with lots of turkeys after me. This is a fun little game. I mean, it's definitely entertaining. So, recommended on this one. Oh boy, more turkeys. More turkeys. Jesus. Oh boy. Where are all these turkeys? Ah! Ah! Jesus! Where'd I have to go? Where's the arrow pointing? Ah! Oh! Okay, it's pointing this way. Let's go this way. I'm glad there's arrows because I have no idea where I'm going. Hey, Darth Blaze! What's up? Oh man, now there's a lot of turkey fun. Oh, jeez! What's this? Oh, Jesus, there's still people coming. Whoa. Ah. Ah. Okay, we're going to have to go here, peeps. All right, follow the arrows. I'm surprised there's not more loading in this game. Okay, didn't the arrow just tell me to go this way? Oh, there's a bear. Oh, dude. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. These turkeys! Oh, they're behind me! 
door open. Okay, it just said door open. What does that mean? Oh, jeez. I imagine we gotta go this way. Am we doing this right or right? Yeah, there's a big chicken. Ah, jeez. Okay, so this controller does now vibrate. I wasn't sure if this controller vibrated, but it's definitely vibrating when you're dying. Door open. Ah, there we go. All right, cheesy poofs. We got some cheesy poofs, y'all. We got them. Now what? Now I have a feeling there's gonna be a lot more turkeys again. Oh jeez. I'm almost done with this stage already. Because I've killed a lot of turkeys. I feel bad. Jesus. Are we almost done with this stage or what? Alright, what's the next game you guys want to check out? Any more games you guys want to check out? On this image? Hopefully something that's fairly easy to uh, digest. Oh, that looks like it's finished line there. Nice. Alright! Minions crushed. 130. All right, now we have a new cheat code, guys. No. Destruction Derby, Croc. Okay, that sounds fun. In Hander, isn't that a, a little bit more of a longer game? Is that, I mean, can I just jump in and play for five minutes, or is that a... Oh, man, now i got to find the others. Still, All right, so that was South Park. Runs great. Cool little game. Uh, Destruction Derby, which one? And then I'll do Croc. We'll do Destruction Derby and Croc. Destruction Derby, one or two. Oh, it is? Okay, I'll check it out. You know, I've already played Destruction Derby in a previous stream, so I'm going to skip that one. Croc is a little bit longer, so I'll do that last, and then I'll do Enchanter. Billy Badass. Why do you think I had the actual system? Because emulation is that good. You don't, you can't even tell the difference. Square Saw. Creator of many great games. Oh man, this game has got a lot of vibration in it, guys. This whole time it's vibrating. Oh yeah. A little massage on the hand. I'm starting not to be able to feel my fingers anymore. We're at war with each other. I had to hit the vibration button to turn it off. So besides my normal um, button, my normal fire button, is there anything else I should use, like a bomb or anything? Uh-oh, we got a Vulcan. Kill the Vulcan. So this is basically like a um, Darius on steroids, right? Oh, I can just hold down the button. That's good. So you can just hold down the button. You don't have to worry about uh, hurting killing your fingers on the uh on the tap tap tapper.
It's kind of cool that it, it's kind of 3D-ish. Or it makes it seem like it's 3D from the background. Cool graphics, too, for a PlayStation. Oh, that's cool that you can kill the signs. That's what I always liked about the movie Blade Runner, was like those scenes where it's like they're in Japan with all the lights and stuff and the Coca-Cola. I always thought that was really cool. The new Blade Runner is going to be so dope. Oh, there's a gun. There's upgrades I gotta get. Oh, sinker missiles and stuff. Get the cannon! Oh! Ah, oh, there we go. I just switched gun. Why, why is it? <laughs> no one fighter left. All right, so that was just a little preview of that game. That was really fun, Paps. Good recommendation. Very nice. And then we got some croc action over here. Yeah, I know. I wasn't catching all the weapons. They were dropping them. I thought that was an enemy at first, but you're right. They were dropping little weapons. You gotta go, go swoop in there and grab them. Good old Fox. Gonna give us some games like Croc. They're also gonna give us The Simpsons. I bet they had pretty big budgets back then. Yeah, it's a really good shooter. Good recommendation. Good old croc. What's up, buddy? Does anybody know the difference between a crocodile and an alligator? Oh, he does like a reverse 360. Change camera. No, I just got good or bad. I need to switch to the analog stick here. Can I kick kill this? This guy's so cute. Ah. I like how he backs it up, too. Got him! Oh! Oh, no! I just lost everything, guys. This is hard to do with the analog stick. Maybe I should stay with the D-pad here. Jesus. Oh, no! Got it. I mean, it looks like a Yoshi game. It looks like a Mario game for sure. Come on, Fireball, go. Oh! Why did that happen? Oh, we gotta catch these guys. Gotta catch them all, Pokemon. 
Can I do something with these boxes that I'm not that I haven't done yet? Oh, there we go. I think I got to do that on the top. Oh, okay. There you go. Alright, I'm guessing this well is either bad or good. Oh, who's this? Oh, that guy's bad. Alright, then we have the gong. Oh, that was easy. Yeah. Tony! What's up, man? Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Thanks for stopping by. I hope you're having a good Independence Day. Jerry D. Yeah, you gotta dig deep. The internet's a hell of a place. See, somebody's setting up fireworks right now. It's like, it's still, it's, what time is it? It's not even noon yet, and people are setting up fireworks. I guess they can't wait. Maybe they got drunk and they're like, let's go set up fireworks, man. Yeah, no. Ah, hey. All right, we got one. Hazu! I like that it's kind of a crocodile instead of a. I don't have a key. I didn't get a key. Got him. Um, a little short. Uh, see, that's the secret there. Don't break it. Alright, so now we gotta go back and get that guy, or do we be on this door right here? What kind of door is this? Yeah, but does my key also work over here? <laughs> Can my key work over here as well? Oh, there's a balloon up there. Got him. Come with me, little buddy. How do you think I get that balloon? You gotta go along the edge? What do you guys think? Ah! I meant to jump. Alright, we're at the one hour. We're at the one hour mark, anyways! There you have it, guys. 256 PlayStation 1 games. A, a really cool collection. Oh, can you guys hear me? Oh, my speaker. There we go. Okay. So there you have it. A lot of really cool PlayStation titles here. Um... These were hand-selected, I know, from a lot of people. Kind of their favorite, you know, PlayStation games. Um, and as you saw, I mean, there's a lot of great games on here. Hours and hours of great games on here. You got the Crash Bandicoots, the Crocs, the RPGs, the racing games, the shoot 'em ups you know, the sport games. Some really cool titles on here. Uh, great fighting games as well. X-Men vs. Street Fighter, SNK vs. You know, all that good stuff. Uh, all of it. All of it. Good, good stuff. Uh, you also have some good shooters like Metal Gear Solid, the Die Hard games, um, a lot of good stuff. So Resident Evil's on here, 1, 2, and 3, Tomb Raiders. Man, man, was PlayStation not a great system? Jeez, Sony killed it on that one. Um, yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this video. There it is. I'm sure people, if you're interested in this, you know, there's things to go around. Unfortunately, I can't put them on this video, but they're out there. And... Uh, Give this a little like, smash that like button. Have a great Independence Day. It is July 4th here in the States. Enjoy your holiday safely, hopefully. And uh, the overclock video is coming soon. The giveaway is coming soon. Other fun stuff like that. And as people have mentioned, almost 9,000 subscribers, guys. Thank you. Thank you for staying in on the long haul and uh, following me for the journey. I hope to continue to, I hope to, continue to produce some good content. And uh, thanks for all the retro love and all the all the great comments and stuff I learned from you guys. Thank you very much. So with that, 
Buddy, thanks for coming in. Country Cletus. No, I do not work for a cat, actually. But people seem to like this hat, so I keep wearing it. Jerry D, what's up? Country Cletus, happy first to you as well. Paps, thanks, man. Thanks for bringing in here. Thanks for all you do for the community. I, I will have my swine apple shirt on in a stream once I get it. And I hope I get it before I go on vacation. Barons, thanks for coming in. Julio, thanks for coming in. Atari's staff room, thanks for coming in. Darth Blaze Anthony, thanks for coming in. IT crowd, thanks for coming in. Billy Badass, Spiky911 USA. Uh, Madlo Pixel, thanks for coming in. JMRS, Rob DeSheep, thanks for coming in, man. IT crowd 59. Julio, thanks for coming in. Alpha Beta, thanks for coming in. Jason Butwell, thanks for coming in. 321 My Destiny, thanks for coming in. Oh, that's as far as I could scroll up. Uh, I know a lot of others were in here as well. Freedom was in here. Um, a lot of the regs. I appreciate it. I love you. And we'll see you guys on the next video, which will be soon. See you guys on that one. All right. Peace out.